explosive! Hello everyone and welcome to the first video on my channel. I am Eminent Powers and I am going to be showing you guys how to unlock the Magma Orcs as quick and fast as possible. Now there are two key requirements for which you need to complete in order to attain this race. The requirements aren't that hard, I managed to do the first half in just a few hours tops. The Ready for War achievement. This is the achievement you should aim to do for first by going over to the, Zul the Zuldazar zone by heading over to the docks and heading on to your warboat as I like to call it. From here you will see Nathanos. He should have a bright red, he should have a bright orange reddish mark above his head once you have talked to him, accept the war campaign and go on from there. After completing the war campaign and completing all the achievements as shown on screen, you should be close to getting the revered status or even just starting revered. Which is great, now there's only one thing left to do and it's the grind. Now guys, this can be a quite this can be frustrating to do so, but with my steps it will be a doddle. There is 21,000 points you will need to level to Exalted, so listen closely and we'll get you there. So for the first step guys that you would want to do is that you want to head over to your faction's capital city, which would be Orgrimmar in this case since this is a Horde allied race. And the first thing you would want to buy is a contract which is for the Honor Bound. Now these Honor Bound contracts will give you 10, 10 points more rep when it comes to doing world quest. Now this might not seem a lot you guys but trust me it will all pay off once you get it. Now guys before we even start our world quest we want to first of all make sure that we're doing the right ones that we need for the Honor Bound. By looking at the world quest and underneath it should say in a small subtitle the Honor Bound. This, this means that this is the right world quest for which we should be doing and once completing this quest guys we will receive a standard 75 rep points with the honor bound plus of the contracts from number 1 we should receive 85 and this is probably one of the best ways of trying to level up with the honor bound. Now guys for the next step you would want to do island expeditions which should be located right over here. Now the how to do this is that you would want to click on the table that says expedition map. And if you're doing this by yourself I recommend doing heroic because that has the best offerings. And you need to collect 36,000 azurite. Once you've completed that it takes about 8 or 9 runs. And after that you would want to talk to Captain Rez Auken and he will offer and he will not only offer you but he will give you 1,500 reputation points for the honor bound. Now guys, there is one more final step which you will need to do in order to unlock the allied race. So what you want to do is that you would want to go to your warboat and then you will find this table that says mission command table. What you want to do is that you want to right click on the table and if you want to look around this quest here, honor bound commendation, this will award you 125 reputation with the honor bound which is really good. This one is quite long, it is 8 hours but it's still worth it guys because it is still reputation with the honor bound. But before you go on ahead and do it you really want to make sure you have at least a 100% chance in doing it. So you would want to drag any companion. So right now only with one companion it's a 100% chance but if you want to just be extra safe you can find another companion and then you would want to just simply click on start mission and then it's in progress so then you need to come back in 8 hours time and then you will unlock 125 reputation with the honor bound. Now all of these guys can be quite different, some could be 4 hours, some could be 5, some can be at least a day or 18 hours but hopefully it shouldn't be that long for you guys. 
So guys, that's the end of the video. Be sure to show your appreciating by giving the channel a quick subscribe. If you want to see more videos like this, me giving you guys tutorials and steps on how to unlock allied races for either the Horde or the Alliance, uh, be sure to leave a comment down below if you guys have any troubles or any questions. And also guys, make sure to keep on following these steps every day and then before long you will be able to unlock the Magma Orcs. I have been Eminent Powers and I will see you guys in the next video.